Hello, outdoor enthusiasts and land investors. This is Josh for usrecland.com. Uh, we're bringing another property. Uh, we've been bringing on a lot of new inventory lately and there's still more to come. So this is just another one and that's set. Uh, so this one is actually in Okaloosa County, Florida. Uh, but as always, please subscribe to our website, usrecland.com for exclusive deals, discounts and waived fees, uh, bundle packages, etc. And then also please subscribe to this YouTube channel and click the notification bell. That way you'll be the first to know of new land coming down the pipe, just like this one, okay? All right, let's jump in. This is Okaloosa County. We're asking 21.9 on this property. It's actually 1.11 acre, uh, acre lot. And uh, this one's in Okaloosa. And you actually have two entrances, uh, two access points on this property, which we'll look at here in a minute. But let's get some of the basics. 1.11 uh, acres. Uh, here's your parcel number for folks that need to call the county to get information for zoning, building, and utilities. We highly recommend it. Uh, here are your Google Map, Earth, and Satellite XY coordinates. You can plug them in, get a free virtual review of the surrounding area and immediate area around the property. Uh, there is access off Chambray Road to the west, and then there's another access point to the east. Uh, which we'll look at when we're on the satellite view. This lot is rated agricultural, uh, so it gives you a little broader zoning as usual. Yes to mobile homes, yes to site built homes, yes to manufactured homes. All RV questions have to be brought to the building department at Okaloosa Zoning. Please contact them, get it straight from the horse's mouth prior to buying the property. And there are no wetlands, no flood zone. Taxes are currently 252 per year. This is a rural lot, so it's well and septic. There is power at the road as there are some other houses in the area. So uh, you should be able to connect fairly easily for your utilities for, or excuse me, for your electric. All right, so let's take a look. Here's an outline of the lot. Here's the access point on Chambray Road. That's where we use the Google coordinates. Uh, but you also, you can see Chardy Road comes right across the front of this here too. So you'd be able to uh, come into the property that way, but it's a nice size, really nice size lot, 1.11 acres. All right. And then uh, here's Chardy Road and here's Chambray Road. There's a house here. Again, houses in the area. Uh, so you definitely have power, uh, but you'll need to look into your uh, septic and well and make sure you understand uh, what additional cost you have to develop. Buying the land's just the beginning, folks. So keep that in mind. All right, here's a broader view. There's your parcel. Poverty Creek Road here is the main thoroughfare. And here's the pin. This is the property here. It's just your entrance point off of Chambray Road. And then this is Chardy Road right here. So again, you have, you have two access points basically. All right. And then this is, I think this is Yellowknife Creek, if I remember correctly. So obviously nobody, nobody behind you. So you still get the uh, benefits of rural living for the most part, just a small, but at the same time, you've got all of the amenities. Here's the airport. Um, looks like another airport, uh, Crestview Aerospace. Emerald Coast Zoo, and uh, huh, here's your Dollar General if you need to get some supplies. And again, we'll look more on the satellite view. And this is just a broader view to let you see like you're, you're just within easy hitting distance of the coast and all of the cool places around the coast here from your property. And then after a long day, out here on the coast, you can retreat to the peace and quiet of your very own little slice of heaven. And just a broader view to show you, you're all the way up in the panhandle of Florida here. So it's fairly close to Mobile uh, and some other points up here in the area uh, if you're into gambling. So we'll show you some of that. So Mobile's an hour and 45, not even two hours. And it's a nice little coastal drive. Uh, Henderson Beach State Park is 52 minutes, so 45, 50 minutes to all the beaches. Here's Miramar, about an hour. So got a lot of access to different places. Um, this is Pensacola, uh, an hour. 
All right, let's take a look. Satellite, here's the pin. This is your access off Chambray Road. Here's the property here. And then Chardy Road. I just put a pin on it just to, this is the property, 1.11 acres, this big long rectangle here. Okay, back it up. There are some houses, so you do have some neighbors if you had an emergency and needed help. There's somebody in the area. It's not completely desolate, but you don't have houses and homes uh, completely sitting on top of you. There's a little room around here. And uh, as you can see, it's just like a nice, quiet little rural development behind here to the south. Uh, there isn't anything because it basically is just a forest and shrubbery down to the river. Let's see. Yeah, Shoal River. I said yellow knife. I apologize. It's Shoal River that's running through there. So here's the Dollar General that we saw. Bob Skies Airport. Oh, sorry about that. Swaney Airport. All right. Oh, we got the kennel. So if you needed to go away for a little while, you can drop the uh, family members off. There we go. Trisha's doggy camp. <laughs> Blackstone Golf Course, Oakwood Hills Park, Twin Hills Park. You have Lowe's down here if you needed supplies. Yellow River Water Management Area. Florida, as always, does a good job with the conservancies and wildlife management. And here's the Yellow River. And again, I think I said Yellow Knife, which is actually somewhere in the Yukon. So it's not Florida. I apologize. Yellow River um, here. Uh, and here's the property just to kind of maintain. So you can see just to hop and a skip from the coast, but yet you can retreat back to your nice, quiet, rural little allotment. Uh, in the country. So kind of get the best of both worlds here. Uh, really nice lot. So uh, we get we get inquiries every day. So it's hard to tell when properties will go off the market. So do your due diligence, verify the property meets all of your personal needs. Nobody else knows what you're looking for and what's a deal breaker and what's not for you for a piece of land. So unfortunately, there's no one else that can do that work other than you. Um, and so please complete that process. And if you see a property that you'd like to purchase from us, we assume that you've already gone through and verified it meets your needs, uh, what you want to build, how you want to use the property in the land, you've already verified everything. So please do that. We want you to be satisfied with your purchase for years to come. Um, but again, we don't, it's a very personal purchase when you're buying land uh, or real estate in general. Uh, no one else knows what's going on in your head. No one knows what's going on in my head on what specifically I'm looking at. So please complete your due diligence, but give us a call because they go quick. So it's kind of like you have to make haste uh, slowly is kind of the, the name of the game is perform your due diligence. Definitely don't get ahead of yourself, but get that process and that phase done over and quickly get the information you need and give us a call uh, because we operate on a first come first serve basis, which is any other land company. All right. So at any rate, let's finish it up. So again, Okaloosa County, uh, really nice big lot, 1.11 acre lot. It's in Okaloosa County in Crestview, Florida. Uh, I think I forgot to mention we're in Crestview on this lot uh, for the city. And we're asking 21.9 on this property. And again, if you wanna take a look, do a little virtual review, uh, definitely we encourage you use those coordinates. You can look around. Um, and see the immediate area. But this is a nice little build lot. If you're looking to retire, if you just want a vacation spot in Florida, there's uh, a couple airports in the area. You have all the amenities, dollar, dollar store, uh, Lowe's and Home Depot, or excuse me, Lowe's. And, uh, and then you have some other attractions and thing and the beaches that are available, um, readily available within an hour. Uh, put in your favorite CD and you're there, okay? 
All right. So again, please subscribe to usrecland.com and then also subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification bell. That way you'll be notified of video reviews and uh, just like this one, as soon as we get new property. Uh, and we've got a lot of new land that's still coming yet. So take a look at our current inventory, see if someone uh, something matches your personal criteria and reach out and let us know. We're happy to get the paperwork started as long as you've completed due diligence. All right, folks, have a good weekend and happy land hunting.